Oh my god, why is my name so noticeably different for no considerable reason? Ah. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back for more, let's play Majora's Mask. I am Hunter, the one who really does not need all this shit. Dog. Hi. Can I kiss you please? Thank you. Okay, anyways, um, yeah, we're back from our Zero's Mask, and in the last part, we traveled back through time, using our Ocarina, which has transformed into these Dickle Peps that are strange and bizarre, and in this part, we're gonna talk to the Happy Mask Salesman and see what's up, um, so, yeah, let's do that quickly before the dog rapes us, no doggy, bad doggy, bad doggy, sit down, okay, good doggy, anyways, hi, were you able to recover your precious item from that inn? Yeah, we did, oh my god, stop shaking me! Man, he's shaking me, man! Look at this! Oh, oh, oh! You got it! You got it! You got it! You got it! Yes, I did get it. Then listen to me. Please play the song that I'm about to perform and remember it well. Yeah, he's kind of Irish-ish, something like that. Left C, right C, down C. Left C, right C, down C. Left C, right C, down C. Let's do that again, kids! Follow me! Left C, right C, down C, left C, right C, down C. Left C, right, down C, right, left C, right, down C, right. And that is the sound of healing. No! Oh! Alien just jumped out of my stomach. Yay for that. Hi, Daku Scrub. I guess you're going now. Bye bye. I'll see you next Tuesday. I don't know why next Tuesday, but yeah, bye. Plunk. And it turns into a mask. And we're back to our normal selves! Yay! Finally! Took a while. This is a melody that heals evil magic and troubled spirits, turning them into masks. I'm sure it would be of assistance to you in the future. Ah, yes, I give you this mask in commemoration of this day. Fear not, for the magic has been sealed inside the mask. When you wear it, you will transform into the shape you just were. When you remove it, you will return to normal. We got a transformation mask! You got the Deku Mask to keep as a memento! Press start and set it to left C, down C, or right C on the select item screen. Wear the mask with C to inhabit the body of the Deku. And press C again to return to normal. Huzzah for that! What? Now, I have fulfilled my promise to you. So please, give me that which you promised me. I, uh, um... Small complications. Don't tell me. My mask... You did... Get it back, didn't you? Um, no. Holy shit, evil eyes! And he's shaking me! Why is he shaking me? What have you done to me? Man, this guy's getting a migraine like no tomorrow. If you leave my mask out there, something terrible will happen. Weird camera angle! I don't know why! It's a weird glitch, don't ask. The mask that was stolen from me, it is called Majora's Mask. That sounds pretty sinister. It low evil red mask. It is an accursed item from legend that is said to have been used in it by an ancient tribe in its hexing rituals. That sounds pretty, uh, pretty evil. It is said that an evil and wicked power is bestowed upon the one who wears that mask. And what explain the Skull Kid's behavior, that's for sure. According to legend, duh. The troubles caused by Majora's Mask were so great that it caused Michael Bay to explode! No, no, it could have caused an apocalypse. The Ancient Ones, fearing such catastrophe, sealed the mask and shadow forever, preventing its misuse. Smart move by those dudes. But now, that tribe from the legend has vanished, so no one really knows the true nature of the mask's power. Mm, that, that, is, that isn't good, though. But I feel it. I bet you do. I went to great lengths to get that legendary mask. When I finally had it, I could sense the doom of a dark omen brewing. It was that unwelcome feeling that makes your hair stand on end. I know that feeling. And now... That impasse it. I am begging you, you must get that ba mask back quickly or something horrible will happen. Okay, Bobby Head. I'm begging you, I'm begging you, you must do it. Really? You'll do it for me? I was certain you would tell me that. You'll be fine. Surely you can do it. Believe in your strengths. Believe. Running away right now. Never again I will talk to you. Okay. That mask! The Skull Kid uses the power of that mask to do those horrible things! Well, whatever it takes, we've got something to do about it. The swamp, mountains, ocean, and canyon that Tail was trying to tell us about. I bet he was referring to the four areas just outside of town. There's one in each compass direction. 
but what do you suppose he meant by the four who are there? Dodo? I have no idea. He always skips important stuff. I guess we should just go and find out. If we go through that gate straight ahead, we'll be headed into the direction of the swamp. Alright, we'll do that, but first, let's do this. This, my friends, is probably the song you want to use the most in the game. The inverted Son of Time. Basically, it's play the Son of Time backwards, literally, like the notes backwards, and time will slow down by four. Four times. It will be four times as slow, if I remember correctly. I think. I don't know. Anyways, what we're going to do is back this thing and flush Cocker Wings. Sorry about that. Alright, and this is basically a quick save spot. Which means that if you save here, you can come back at the same time you save. Blah 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 blah. All that good stuff. Okay, first thing we're gonna do is go over here, get that heart piece, and get these rupees before they disappear forever from my grasp. No, yes, no. barely enough again. Son of a gun. I hate it when that happens. All right, so we're gonna actually. Can we get that now? I wonder if we can get that now. No, no, we shouldn't bother. We can't be damned to bother. We can't be damned to get that now. It is blasphemy. Anyways, this is my second take of this part because I kind of screwed up the recording really badly last time. If I screwed up, I mean I messed everything up. It was epic, freaking fail, and I hated it, and I don't like it. So we're gonna do this from the beginning. All right, now to pop this balloon. Yes, we know how that works. All right, let's throw the notes over here. Throw my notes over on this side. All right, let's transform into the Deku. Let's go. Watch, that'll be the thumbnail. That'll be hilarious. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so... Damn it, Tingle, stop it! Yes, the Tingle. Hello! Goodbye! And he's dead. No, 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 he's not. Too bad. I wish he was dead. And I could just steal his maps. Then I would have to pay for them. What's this? Green clothes? What fairy? Sir, could you be... By chance, a forest fairy? Oh my! My name is Tingle. I think I'm the same as you, sir. A forest fairy. Alas, though I am already age 35, no fairy has come to me yet. You need to do something with your life, buddy. Seriously. My father tells me to grow up and act my age, but why? I tell you, Tingle is the very reincarnation of a fairy. No, you are the very reincarnation of a pedophile. Now, while I stand here waiting for a fairy of my own, I sell maps to help out my father. Lucky, lucky, you're so lucky to have a fairy. I know, I know, we should be friends. Yes, yes, in exchange, I'll sell you a map for cheap as a sign of my friendship. Will you buy one of Tingle's maps? Uh, sure, we'll buy the Clock Town one. Yippee! We got a town map! Because off that, the red arrow on the map shows where you entered, and the yellow arrow shows your current location. Welcome again! Tingle, Tingle, Kola Loompa! These are the magic words that Tingle created himself. Don't steal them. Original the character! Do not steal! Alright, enough of that. Well, let's take off this mask. And skip the cutscene and ensues. Actually, wait. Let's skip this. I'll show you I'll show you the cutscene when you take off the mask. Yeah, that's weird, I know. Oh, don't fall. Right, let's hop up here. Hop up here. And camera. Light and roll. A line and roll. And heart base. You got a new heart container! No, I'm not gonna do that. You got a piece of heart, you summoned a new heart container, your maximum life energy has been increased! Piss off that. Alright. Uh, where to go now? I must get some rupees from somewhere. I don't know just where to get them. Luckily, if I didn't know where to get them, I would have done something crude and evil. But luckily, I don't have to do that. Crossing our fingers, however, that we'll be able to get over there this time around. That's what we can. Come on. Let's see if we can do this now. Get up. Alright, you can. We can. Don't worry, we can. Good, we can. Okay. So, I'm sure most of you know about this one because of this being like infamous and stuff like that. But if you roll over there and roll onto here, you'll find a treasure chest. What is inside, but. A silver rupee! It's worth 100 rupees! You're pretty happy! I'm happy! So happy! So happy! Alright, um, uh, where to go now? Mine part. Ah, right over here! We go over here! Which is over here, by the way. Just letting you know that. Now, although we. Ow! Although there was a ton of crap we can now do outside of Clock Town because. As you. Uh, actually, I might as well show you what happens if you try to go outside of Clock Town as a Deku. 
Because I haven't shown you that yet, really. So you go over here, this guy's like, I'm gonna block you. I'm gonna follow you like a stalker and block you. Hi. Wait a moment, Dr. Scrub, have you some errand at the ocean? Yeah, this is the way to the ocean, by the way. It's dangerous outside of town walls, so I cannot allow a child like you to go along well. Unless you're, until you're old enough to carry a weapon, you cannot pass through here without being accompanied by adults. Alright. Fine, be like that. I'll just transform in front of you and magically take out a sword. Hi. Can we talk again? Stop right there. Have you an errand at the ocean? It is dangerous outside the town walls, so I can't allow a child like you to... A sword? My apologies, sir. It was fun of me to treat you like a child. At Great Bay, you could cl you could see clear to the ocean. It lies this way. Be careful. I am not going that way. I am not going that way. And yes, spoilers, that is a location where we just come in and catch up. Hi! I get a donate to the bobblehead. Okay. Repos well, deposit rupees. I'm not sure if the amount I donated here was different from the last time, but... Alright. We're gonna donate 20 rupees. And... Seriously, that's a lot! A lot! A lot! Alright, little guy, now you've got a total of 207 rupees from you. What's this? You've already saved up 200 rupees? Well, little guy, here's your special gift. Take it! We got an adult wallet! This was for adults, so it holds a lot of rupees. Now you can carry up to 200 of them! Huzzah! See? Doesn't it hold more than your old one? Fill it up and bring it... Uh, and bring it all in to deposit. Huzzah! We jazz hands. Alright. Now that we've done that, we are going to go in here. Which is very weird looking. Ooh. Very oriental, it would appear. And I'm not going to talk about this guy. This guy, I don't know what kind of voice, but... Basically, he says, Hello, want to do my training sessions? And I will do the expert course, thank you very much. And... Yeah. 30 points! Alright, 30 points, 30 points, 30 points. So, let's see. Z-target and jump. Oh, wait. Alright, jump slash. Ah, crap, I already screwed it up. Dude, targeting. Why can't you just jump attack like anything else normally? Dude. Alright, basically what you gotta do is do jump attack like... Like, uh, 15 times. No, X amount of times. Anyways, I screwed up, so let me try that again. Or just teleport. Either one. Poly teleport. Teleport! Success! Perfect score! And then take as long as I thought it would. Hmm, impressive. I must give you something. Here! We got a piece of fart! Alright. And unbelievable, cherish it well. I will cherish it well, and now I will leave you forever. Goodbye! Alright. Now that we've done that, uh, let's see. Ah, I know what we can do next. And then we're off this part. There's one last thing we can do right now. And that is talk to Madonna again! But first, we have to get a great fairy. Like usual. Sad face or not. Alright, so what we're gonna do is go back over here where we were and got the great fairy the first time. Um, stray fairy, excuse me. And, uh, hello, Mr. Stray Fairy Person. You are gonna be my friend. Blah, 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 speech. Alright. And now, teleport to Madonna. I said, teleport to Madonna. Teleport to Madonna. Okay, we're in Madonna's place, and we're a kid again, somehow. Don't ask, wrong story. Alright. So now that we got the Stray Fairy, let's give it to Madonna. And magic is spinning, 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 spinning. Spin. Cyclone! Madonna! <laughs> Alright. Hello. Are you doing things? Hello, how's it? Oh, Tuttle, and you, kind one, young one. Blah, 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 return to the speech, okay. But this time, she is going to give us something different. Whoa, floaty body. Floaty body. No, I don't want a shot of that. Thank you. That's very wrong. Oh, kind gentleman. Scattered throughout the four. Okay. Yeah, basically, same dealio. And we get a mask. That lets us find them. So? We got our neck mask. You got the great fairy mask. Wherever see stray fairies will fly to you when you wear it. You'll know when you're close to a fairy who's lost in a temple of the masked heirs. That's the shimmer. Come and see me when you're wearing a crest. Blah, 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 blah. Use your shill. And next up, let's play Majora's Mask. We're going to be... Doing more stuff in Clock Town and getting more stuff in Clock Town. Yay for that. So until then, see you later and goodbye.